today we're exploring this abandoned house of a um, serial killer that lived in Rhode Island. His name is Jeffrey Mailhot. Um, he's basically known as the Rhode Island Ripper. He murdered three prostitutes. Um, you know, chopped up their body with a saw. And basically dumped them in the trash. And his, his crime span, was, I believe, was 2003 to 2004. And now he's in prison for life, obviously. What's down there? Nothing. No? No, no point. Can't, can't believe we found this dude's house. Can't believe it either. Wait till you see that. We got a photo over here. Wonder if this is his kid. Wonder if he left any bodies in the fridge. I'm gonna have to check. Surprisingly, it does not have a bad smell. I... <laughs> Usually, that stuff stinks. What's this stuff? Now we're gonna go in his living room. As you can see, this calendar is dated 2005. And I believe that's when he was apprehended. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. I, I didn't do much research on it. No, I, I didn't also. I just got the word of this place and I was like, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Put that down there. So his backyard. So imagine one time there was like an actual yard back there, like what grass. Like with all those weeds. I know, right? It's just insane how how they had quick. A too back there. Yeah, yeah, I just noticed that. His family members over here. See, I don't know if he, like, actually, like, this was his house or he was, like, staying with family. Yeah, I don't you know. know. You know what I mean? Maybe it was his hideout for a while. It's an old school video right here. A 
photo. I mean, it could be of his mother, grandmother. It's 1956. Some drawing from some little kids' drawings. Powerball from two thousand six. Wonder if it's a winner. Them hand puppets over here. Professionals, old western. A total view of the living room. It's not a big house. It looks like it's uh, two bedrooms. Yeah, yeah. Wow, look, they put a fan in the refrigerator. <laughs> yeah. And I, I, was, I was hoping to find a body in there or something, you know? Yeah. <laughs> I guess you never know. Paperwork. So yeah, this is a small house, everyone. Um, but again, you know, uh, our family was murdered here. stuff was left in this house. No oh, wait, is this a one bedroom? I don't know if that's a bedroom or that's a dining room or something. It's got a table on it. It's weird. Let's see, where's this lead to? Yeah, this leads right outside, so yeah. This is a very small house. Yeah. This room is trashed pretty bad.
Let's say there's some cards down here. Happy 39th birthday. could ever want love me <laughs> wish I could find more photos in here Through this, too much of this. It's very dusty in here. Mm, I'm gonna check out the bathroom. See, they left all their stuff in here. Somebody took the piping out, scrappers most likely. They say this is definitely not a huge house. I thought it was a two bedroom, it's only a one bedroom. One bedroom, living room, kitchen, and the bathroom. That's pretty much it. Let me get the garage to check out. What we got in here? Day.
see what we got going on out here. Looks like you got a shed back there. Shed, you got a greenhouse back there. All right, so this is the garage. There's a lot of stuff in here. Kind of just throwing around though. All that mold. Ugh. That woman's clothing over here. Almost looks like a tail from like a fox or something. There's a bunch of clothes. Bunch of trash in here. We're going to take a quick look at this basement, see what's down here. Hopefully I don't fall down these stairs. way out the back. Kind of trashed.
just like a boiler room over there. Uh. Well, guys, that's the whole house. These things. Yeah, it's not worth it down there. Yeah, Almost looked like somebody started cleaning this out and then it they just stopped. Yep. <coughs> this is uh trash bags. 